So Cherry Hill hits 10 years this year. Wow, that's hard to believe. I'm Scott Monkern. I teach at Cherry Hill. I've been on the staff at Cherry Hill. I'm a pagan author. I also lecture at a number of pagan conferences. I'm in a Northern European tradition, just if you're curious. So Cherry Hill, um, my wife started at Cherry Hill, not when they first opened, but pretty early on. And I started a couple years after that, not as a student, but helping them with technical issues and then going on later to teach at Cherry Hill. Cherry Hill has been a leader in pagan education. While there have been online pagan education sites around for years, Cherry Hill has really tried to take it to the next step, where it's not just about the basics of paganism and Wicca and Asa True and so on and so forth, but trying to offer some really advanced professional level training, both from a pastoral counseling standpoint to a chaplaincy standpoint, to pagan leadership, because pagan leaders have always had a problem of where do I go to for help? I've been a pagan leader a number of years and this question is, is I want to set up a conference. How do I do that? And no one's there to help me. So uh, I congratulate Cherry Hill on really stepping up and adapting themselves to providing the pagan community a lot of the resources and materials they need for their leadership. And I think that's really neat of Cherry Hill to do. They've been really adaptive in the way they're approaching things. Uh, they're constantly trying new models on how can we deliver information, how can we communicate effectively, and they've had some really top-notch instructors that have been really adaptable as well. I remember going back to the very, very first few weeks that I was there, teaching instructors how to use Moodle and talking about the concept of putting up an MP3 file or some kind of co audio content. To, now that's just kind of a given. Instructors know how to do that. So. Congratulations to Cherry Hill to really advancing pagan education online. Uh, good luck in your first, next 10 years. I'm sure there will be interesting things to come wherever you go.